Hello friends and welcome to the video tutorial of web push notification for Magento 2. Now by the help of this module the admin can send push notification messages to its subscribed user on their web browser. The biggest advantage of using push notification is its ability to deliver messages instantly. These messages can contain any information like product launch information, new offer information and any product update information. Now unlike the mails which may or may not be read by the customer and it may land up in the spam or junk folder. Web push notifications prompt and assured content delivery feature ensures that the notification are for sure delivered and seen. As long as the browser is running, a subscribed user will get a pop-up message on the screen even without opening up their website. In the website, we refer your store URL. So coming to the installation of this module, once you have downloaded the module, you will be getting it in a zip format. You have to unzip it, then you will be getting the module folder. Click on the module folder, you will be getting the SRC folder. Click on the SRC folder, you will be getting the app folder. Now you have to upload the app folder into your Magento 2 directory and then you're done with the installation. For the better understanding about the module and its installation, you can also refer to the user guide. Now let's come to the configuration of this module. Now this is my admin panel. So I will go to my store and then my configuration and now you can see your push notification menu so click on push notification menu now you will see your general settings so click here and then you can see server key and sender id so you have to enter your server key and your sender id and then you have to save your configuration for receiving your sender ID and server key you have to go to your Firebase console so go to your Firebase console the URL is console.firebase.google.com so after you have logged in then you have to create a new project so I will click here and then you have to name your project like fun project 2 you have to select your country and then you have to click on create project and now your project is getting created and now go to your settings and then go to project settings now you can see general tab so go to your cloud messaging and then you can see your sender id and server key so you have to copy your sender id and you have to paste over here and again you have to copy your server key and you have to paste over here and then from here you have to save the configuration now my configuration has been saved now go to your menu push notification now you will see your two sub menus notification templates and registered user so click on notification templates now you can see your notification templates so you can see your already existing templates so you can select them and from here you can delete them you can see the template title the message of the template the redirect url the logo the tags when it was created from here you can edit them so i will create a new template so click on create new now you will see a new page so you have to enter your title for example bumper offer and your message you have to enter your message now you have to enter the URL of the product or any site where you want to redirect your customer now you have to enter the tag and then from here you have to upload the template logo now you can see I have uploaded my template logo my tag URL message and title and now I will save the template so now your template has been saved and you can see in the grid now again go back to your
push notification and click on registered user so now in this registered user you can see the user who has subscribed your notification and from which browser they have subscribed and on what time and date so you can see the id from here you can select individual and you can either delete or you can send notification and from here you can select the template and these are the user token so now let's move to the front end now this is my front end so i will refresh this url again and then this will ask me that i would like to receive notification from this site or not so i will click on receive notification and then i'll go back to my admin and and again i will refresh this page and then you can see over here id number 17 this is the user token and i subscribed from firefox and this is the your time and date so i will select this customer and from here i will send notification this one bumper offer so it will ask me if i'm sure or not so i will click on ok and then your notification is getting sent so you can see it has been sent and now you will receive the notification so you can see the notification this is the title this is the message and this is the logo and now this is the site name from where you will send the notification so if i will click anywhere then it will redirect to the url which we have entered while entering our template so this was the url so like this you can send push notification to your subscribed user so this is all about this module if you have any doubt regarding this module you can raise a support ticket at support at thank you very much for watching this video tutorial